What's up guys? This is your boy Russian. We are broken and maybe dead. But this is Hapelsi News. What's up guys? So, before we get into the Halloween event, uh, there's a few things we need to discuss about what's going on with the game right now. So, I was actually approached by some of the players on Discord. Um, there seems to still be a lot of people that are having issues right now with their accounts. So, their account right now have none of the characters they used to have prior to the merge. So, I tried to contact uh, GMs and it seems that one of the issues they talk about is, well, maybe the person created two different accounts. Uh, the problem with that is the person is still able to log into their game, what it means they should have the characters in there. And what is happening right now, and I was sent all the screenshots and all the talks back and forth between the player, Webzen, Webzen, and Bora. Because every time the person puts a ticket, they seem to be sending that to Webzen. And then Webzen close the ticket and send them to Bora. And I could tell that was like a couple of dozen uh, tickets back and forth. So I know there are some issues with people that have been transferred on the right time that still have problems with their characters. I'm just trying to figure out if that's in whose end it is right now. So if you guys are having some issues with that, please let me know in the comments. Uh, I'm trying to figure out all the issues that that transfer has given one other issue that seems to be happening right now is so so I was told by a player actually you guys can check that in one of the comments in the video um, I have I can't remember which video that was that the player actually came back to the game and left the game after a week having to deal with Capture. So, those security issues have been major for a lot of people. It, it is pretty annoying. I know a lot of people have been complaining. And I do know uh, some people are trying to work on that problem, maybe to remove or not. Um, it's all gonna be up to Bora, but I know it's pretty annoying every now and then when I Actually, lately more than ever, when I go to log in my account, I have to go into Capture. The problem is, it tells me, for example, to click in every single car, and I click in every single car, and it says, nope. All right, click on every bus, no buses. Click on every motorcycle, and it just goes for a while. So, it is pretty annoying when you just want to get to the game and play the game and be done with Sad. Now, again, if you guys have any opinions on that, let me know in the comments below. Now, let's talk about the Halloween event. So, Halloween event. There's one major change that I noticed between Boring Webs and so last year, for example, in the years prior to it, Halloween event, uh, the drop table seemed to be mostly even for drops when the game was under Webzen. This year it's a little bit different. So 
After a few hundred uh, tokens that I dropped in there, so I realized one thing: there are things that just don't drop. Masks. They're not really dropping. Um, I'm not saying they don't drop at all. I'm saying it's very, very small amounts. Um, same thing with the cloak, Halloween cloak. And I saw that same problem on the last event. It really, I, I, I understand some of the items being uh, a smaller percentage. And it makes a lot of sense. At the same time, I wouldn't like to have a thousand masks or Halloween cloaks in my inventory. But the problem is some of those drops are way too low. Same happened the last event with the keys. So I got no keys at all. Um, I know probably some people did, um, but there are very, very low amounts, I guarantee. Same thing with numbered boxes. Numbered box I did get, but I'll be honest, after a few hundred tokens, actually a lot more than a few hundred tokens, there are some items I expect to see at least once or twice, one or two of them. Um, I'm not even expecting too many. And I really saw none. So I wish someone could take a look in how that drop table is going on. Um, I haven't seen a single Ultimate Witch card. What does bother me, because that means the percentage is so low that even after a few hundred you don't get one. And I know a lot of people are seeing things with Bore. I don't... Look, let me explain. Listen, I'm not against Bore. And I don't side with Bore or WebZen or any anybody on that level. Now, the only thing is, I do feel that while they're just getting the game, and I understand they have to start to make money in the cash shop, they also need to recognize that completely removing certain drops or putting that solo that even if you drop a thousand tokens or a uh, thousand harvest, harvested souls and you can't get anything to drop it's kind of frustrating like i'll be honest i've been playing just a couple of hours a day for that reason because farming is fine but after a while i'm just fed up um i have other games that i have received keys to reveal so i need to spend time on those two now would I rather be spending time in a decent drop event? Yes. But since I'm not getting that, um, I'll just spend enough time to accumulate enough stuff I need. But that's it. All right, guys. So that's basically it. I don't see many major news happening right now besides for Maybe in about two weeks, we may or may not have the Halloween Dungeons. Um, I was actually reminded at Discord that last year was the same thing. It started with the drop event and then we had the Dungeons for Halloween on the Necromancer Uprising. Now it's time to wait and see if the same thing going to happen. We just came from I would say a major event and we're jumping into another one so let's see if we're gonna have a third one back to back to back anyway guys that's pretty much that for today I know today's a little bit different everything's turned off I only have one light right here microphone down here but it's Halloween so I wanted to make things a little bit darker and if you guys haven't subscribed, please don't forget to do so, that helped me a lot. I do need to keep the channel monetized, so hey, every time one of you guys subscribe, that tells YouTube that people actually watch my videos and it helps a lot. Also give me a like, leave a comment, comments are great for me as well. 
I'll be coming with videos more to the end of the week. Uh, the next one probably gonna be Aquinox Deep Descent. If you guys ever played the series, the game just got released uh, about a week ago. I actually was given a key to review that game. It's a miracle to get a brand new game key. So that's awesome. Um, I've been playing the game. I want to try to at least finish the game before I do the review, so that's gonna take a few days. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, and as always, I'll see you in the game.